to this installment of Violin with Jill. We've got a special guest today to help us with our monkey song. So if you hear some squeaking, it's just squeak. Thank you, squeak, for your assistance today. Now we are going to use the bow in this video um, because we're going to play it. So grab your bow and your violin. Parents, guardians, practice partners, this is what we're going to be looking for. You will have a back view again so that you can see um, what it should look like from all angles. So in between each notes, we're gonna give our thumb a wiggle like this, and we're gonna make sure that the wrist is staying in this really nice um, straight, um, no squashed tomato position. So here we go, I'll say. So I'm a little monkey. Place one down on its sticker, wiggle your thumb, Climbing up the ladder. Two down just before the next sticker. Wiggle your thumb, checking tomatoes. Climbing to the top two. Three goes on its sticker, wiggle your thumb. Tomato check. Eat my gold banana. I'm gonna play three again. Doing your wiggle and tomato check. I'm a little monkey. We're gonna just gently lift three. Climbing down the wiggle, climbing down the ladder. Lifting the two ever so slightly, wiggle your thumb, tomato check. Climbing to the ground two. And just lifting our first finger gently, wiggle thumb, tomato check. Eat my gold banana. All right, so you can just go back and repeat that through. What, again, what we're looking for is a no squash tomato and our fingers just going down really in this really nice rounded shape. And when they come back up, they just lift ever so slightly. We're not getting fireworks um, and that the thumb is um, still nice and relaxed. So doing this a little bit every day is going to be more helpful than playing it for longer but fewer times during the week so um, this doing it a little bit more often will help really set finger muscle memory as well as like mind memory of where things should go all right so happy practicing